Hey guys, Celtic Fire here, back in another part in Pokemon White. In the last part, we headed here to the something tower. I forget what it's called. I want to say Celestial, though. <clears throat> and in this part, we're going to continue our way up it. So it looks like we got a trainer battle here. I just forgot what I saw. Who is leading off again? Simipore. That's... Let's start off with Joltik, actually. <clears throat> and... Let's face this person, because I feel like this is going to be like the Pokemon Tower where there's ghost-type people here. Indescribable energy is flowing to me. Or, yeah, that seems like something a psychic would say, so... Yep, so we got some psychic and ghost-type, I'm sure. That's an odd thing. That looks like it's a rock-type, actually. So, I guess just in case it is psychic, let's give it a try. And use uh, x -Scissor. Super effective? Nice, okay, it is. What did it just use on us? Okay. <laughs> I, that, that doesn't really bother me, but whatever. Let's use Slash. That didn't kill it? Okay, well I guess knock it out. You know what I meant. And there goes Elgin there. That thing. <laughs> And now it's going to send out a Solacis. I don't... Solacis definitely looks like if it's going to be Psychic type. Yeah, it just looks like it's going to be Psychic type, especially if it's Psychic has it. Not, not like the other one that looks like it was supposed to be half rock type. But anyway, Joltik leveled up. That's good. And what do we got next? Siglyph again. So, well, I could either keep Joltik out there, because I could do an... Electric type attack, or does Simipore have a dark type move? It does. Okay, we'll send that Simipore out there. Because and I think it also has a rock type move, so that will help too. Didn't realize how much many uh, weaknesses Siglyph has. But that's okay. Siglyph's have been a good part of our party. Let's see which one's going to do more damage. Bite or Rock Tomb? Ooh, Bite did a lot. And it flinched. Good. Okay, let's bite one more time, and that should take it out. Good job, Simipore. I'm so happy for you. And you leveled up. Wow, two level ups already. Editing's gonna be a nightmare. Doreen. Mm-hmm. Alright. And I think you have an item behind you, miss. But I can't go over there yet, so I guess we'll keep... <sighs> yes, lass. Meow, meow, meow. Oh. Do you have some cat fetish, lady? I don't need to know about it. Oh no. Last Kara. Kara's gonna sell a deerling. Okay, that's good. That means Joltik should be able to take it out. His bug type can take out grass type. As long as they're not grass poison, which most of them are, unfortunately. So, that's okay. His bug type does take out psychic types, which is a very common type to have in a team. So, bug doesn't exactly lose all of its. Yeah. Lose all of its usefulness, I guess I should say. Bug, but uh, having it subtyped with something else is nice. Gothita, what is that? I'm just gonna take a guess. That looks like it's dark type, so that's not a problem to me. X scissor, there we go. Because dark type is weak to bugs as well. And there we go. Yeah, no problem, cat fetish lady. Anyway, I continue. What's, what's this item over here? Hyper Potion, nice. And can I avoid battling that guy? I can, good. Oh. Don't. No. No. Okay, maybe I have to. Okay, come up here, lady. Lady, I'm looking at you, but you aren't looking at me. There we go. So I can get that item. Oh, you won't have a battle with me. Alright, I've strung the Pokemon. Whatever you say, lady who sounds old. Oh, I guess you are an old lady. Pokefan Georgia. Looks like she has, yeah, as I say, she looks like she has a sea waddle. But I guess it's more, I guess it's actually a swaddloon. I feel like this is bug grass type, so... I'm going to switch to Siglyph. I could be completely wrong, though, because like I said, I don't know this generation that well. This is a semi-blind walk through because I've seen somebody play this uh, before. That's actually going to be super effective. That's not good. 
Mm. Um, but I don't know the types really that well, so I apologize if I completely got any of the types wrong. I'm just basing it off of appearance. This looks like it's bug grass type, which I could be right. I could be wrong. It at least looks grass type, though. <clears throat> and I know Siglyph can take that out. Alrighty. Let's continue on our way past this lady with the butter stick or whatever it was. Will-O-Wisp. I don't know what that is. <laughs> That's not a move I've seen before, I don't think. Will-O-Wisp. Go to the TM place. Will-O-Wisp. Right there. Fire attack. Use Hmm. I don't think anybody on my team can learn it, though. But just in case... <clears throat> no. It would be nice to have a fire type move, though, eventually. But I have a feeling that none of my people can. or. yeah. None of my things can learn it. No, I don't want to learn retaliate. I'm just looking at the other TMs I have. Okay, let's continue up the stairs. Up the. there we go. Gotta find Skyla. I don't remember the voice I did for her last week, but. I'll try to see if I can remember it. Anyway, I'm going to switch out and start off with Simipore here. And let's face the Psychic. Oh, maybe I don't have to. Nice. Okay. Looks like I have to fight this guy. Oh, there's a nurse here. What pleases sleeping spirits is a hot battle. Whatever you say, man. And Psychic Mickey. Hey, Mickey, you're so fine, you're so fine, I'll blow my mind, hey, Mickey. I know it's Mickey, but it still works. Alrighty. Well, if it's, he's a psychic, he has a ghost or psychic type, so that should be no problem if we bite it. And a nice mum mummy. What's mummy? Ominous wind, uh-oh. That doesn't sound good. That sounds ominous. Alrighty, bite one more time, Simipore. Good job. Actually, hmm, Golex. I don't know what that is. Actually, we're going to keep Semipore out. Oh, it looks like it's a rock type, so let's use Scald. Okay. And super effective. Nice, my guess was right. So that is a rock type. Which is odd to have for a psychic to have, but whatever. Maybe it's rock psychic or something and I want this item don't look at me ah, didn't want you to look at me and you know what this is the one time I'm actually gonna do this on screen I am going to fast forward this battle on actually the only has one Pokemon never mind holy moly that thing looks ugly semi-poor please get this out of here I mean that I don't even know like an alien and jelly. Like an alien baby. Growing inside the jelly. Simipod, you fainted. Oh no. Um, let's use mint. We haven't used mint in a while. I feel like it's close to uh, evolution too. So let's use leaf tornado. I don't know why I had to do that. But uh, it felt necessary. Mint, you have leveled up. Leaf Blade, ooh, that's good. that sounds like it's a good move. 90 power, ooh, critical hit slam. So that's gonna be better than Mega Drain. Yeah, that is, okay. Give me Mega Drain. <clears throat> and uh, learned Leaf Blade. Nice, okay. And Psychic Bryce was taken out. And uh, let's continue on our way. Just want the item. Don't look at this way. Look the other way. Stop it. Okay, if I take this item, I don't want you to face me, okay? One, two, three, take it. Take it. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna run, 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 don't face me. Damn it. Okay. Well, if this person doesn't have one Pokemon, then I'm gonna fast forward this battle. Yes, I'm actually going to use the fast forward button on this battle because. I don't want to... Okay, no, she has one Pokemon. Not bad. Musharna. I knew what that is. That's a Psychic type. And I know Siglyph. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I'm starting off with the wrong Pokemon. I thought it was going to be Joltik. Um, let's fly. Because nothing Psychic's going to work against it. 
And side beam, that's okay, because I'm going to use... What? What? No. Siglyph. Don't be the Spiro of this game now. Even though I guess that in the last LP, Spiro was a, only missing a lot. The beginning of the LP. Got a lot better once we get... Oh, goodness. I'm going to have to change Pokemon. Oh, Sparky. Come out with your stout -lidness. See what it looks. Oh yeah, he's a big doggy now. What does Lucky Chant do? Okay, whatever. I'm gonna crunch you. Crunch. That didn't do as much damage as it, damage as I would hope. That's probably because it's doing Defense Curl, which is raising raising its defense. And Crunch is actually a physical type move. Why can't this be Generation Three where Dark Type was special? I think at least it was special. <laughs> uh, no, I actually liked that they changed the type thing. So it wasn't based on type, but based on what the move was. Because seriously, why would Thunder Punch and Ice Punch and Fire Punch, why would those be special type moves? You're actually physically hitting them. It's not like Hitmonchan would get arms out of nowhere and just punch people. It made no sense. Uh, Siglyph level up. Nice. And we defeated Bell. I know I've probably said that many times, but I'm just glad they switched that. Okay, I definitely need to face this nurse lady, though. Nurse lady! Yes, I need your help. And yes, I will continue. Actually, I think we had to fight her anyway, but that's okay. She has two Pokemon. Sachiko! She has a Gapita. Which, again, I think is dark type, so anything psychic's not going to work against it. It's Frisk. Okay, whatever. Um, I'm going to use... Duh, duh, duh. Let's use Joltik. Because if it lands an attack on me, then at least then I can do Volt Switch to somebody else. And we're going to unnerve it. Flatter! Oh, that's cute. What did it do? Special attack. Anyway, oh, okay. So it's like the opposite of uh, Swagger. Which is unfortunate, because I could use it... <laughs> oh, excuse me. I could use uh, Swagger over... Whatever that was. Charm, whatever. Future... Ah, future Sight. Okay, let's use Slash. Slash those prices. Use a Blizzard Deeper! No! no, no. Okay, you slashed out, or slashed out of confusion. You snapped out of confusion. I appreciate that. And let's use x -Scissor. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. And Joltik level up? Nope. It's probably because I have too many... Ugh, Joltik! Survive! You can do it! Oh. Uh, okay. <laughs> um, let's use Excadrill. It's been a while since I used him. Alamomola. What is that thing? Okay, well, let's use... I hope it's not water type. It looks like that could be a fish. It is. Crap. Because that's the only time... Because I know steel is not very effective against water. Let's use bulldoze. Or you could use protect, whatever. Um, actually, this would be a perfect time to switch to mint, then. And use its new move. Mint, come save me, please. Thank you. Let's use that new leaf blade move. See what that looks like. And if that's a water type move, that's not very effective. Okay, good. Leaf Blade! Ooh, it has more PP too, and then it's higher. Yeah, slashing him. Slashing those prices. Every Pokemon I have likes to slash prices. Stop sla- Where are your arms? Your fins do not count as arms to slap me. I refuse to believe that's possible. Yes, I know it protected itself, thank you. Let's use Leaf Blade. Get a crit. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Mint. Excadrill. Sachiko. Heal me. Heal me right now. Thank you. Okay. And let's continue up our stairs here. And. Um, what's up here? Oh, more psychics. Oh, actually, no, those are ace trainers, aren't they? I think so. 
Let's start out. Yeah, Semipore still needs to catch up a little bit. Oh goodness, I don't even want to remember all the stuff or all the editing with the levels. But anyway, I guess we'll continue. Can I avoid one of them? I can. I don't know if that's Shadow Claw. Ooh, that's a ghost type. That's a good ghost type move. However, I don't have a ghost type. I was going to, like I said, with the uh, the candle thing, whatever that is. But let's just see if any of our Pokemon can learn it. Ooh, Excadrill and Semipore. Um, Excadrill, I like your moves, though, that you have right now. So Semipore, let's get rid of one of your moves. That... And Rock Smash might be that move, because... I don't really use it as much anymore, so let's get rid of Rock Smash. Ta-da! Okay, Shadow Claw, nice. That's a good Ghost-type move. And I guess we have to fight you as long as I don't... I don't no, maybe not. Oh, I forgot I have repels on. I must not have been uh, moving too much. And also, in this episode, I would like to give just a shout-out to Pokefan, because without him, I would not have over a thousand views right now. He is the reason I got a surge of subscribers over the summer and I just appreciate everything that you've done for me man it is amazing that you watch my videos I still watch yours and uh, if you guys want to check him out I'll leave uh, his channel down in this description and he's doing a Pokemon Heart Gold walkthrough right now and after Heart Gold he is planning on doing a Pokemon hack of red called Brown so uh, give him a give him a look he's a good po he's a good let's player so Anyway, let's continue on after that little spiel. Pokemon, I grew up in Nova, and Pokemon, I grew up elsewhere. Okay, whatever. <sighs> Sometimes I just get ahead of myself. Ace Trainer Cassandra. Swoorat. So that means we could try our new Shadow Claw move, or we could bite it as usual, but I want to try Shadow Claw, because I think Shadow Claw does more base damage. Thanks. Oh yeah, Amnesia does it to itself, not me. I don't understand how that raises its special defense, but whatever. Oh! Goodness me! Actually, all his move, all Simipore's move can take out a Swoobat, so keep that in mind. Simipore, ah, oh, infatuation! I did not think I would have to deal with that this game. Because there's no Clefairies or any stupid stuff like that that. Yeah. Simi poor. Why are you in love with that ugly thing? It's a swoobat. Look how ugly that is. You don't want to make the babies with the swoobat. No. So, Simi poor, I'm going to give you this lemonade. I'm going to hope you figure this out. You don't want swoobat. You don't want it. Rock Doom. You're gonna keep getting slashed by it. I don't know why you think it. <sighs> I don't even know what to say. Oh, Simi It's a bat. You're being attracted to a bat. You're a monkey. You can do better. <laughs> oh, lowdy. Oh, I'm gonna guess that's gonna make me flinch. Okay, Simipore. Yes! Good job, Simipore. You took out your love after all the, or your love of your life after all that abuse you had to go through. Gotharita. Um, yeah, because ghost type wouldn't work against Dark, so. Joltik! Come back out, please. Thank you. Joltik would have worked last one, except for all the air slashes. Ugh. What? That wasn't. Uninterest or that was a very interesting uh, noise you made there, Gotharita. I'm going to just use an X-Scissor. Uh, okay, that's okay, because a future site won't land as long as this X-Scissor lands and takes you out. Good, okay. And actually, Joltik should actually level up. I just said should a lot. Or actually, one of the two. I don't even remember. 
Your Pokemon are full of life. I know they are. Thank you. I'm going to go heal real quick. Please don't look this way. I don't want... No, no. Look this way. Look this way. I want to go heal! Look the other way. Hey, look. <gasps> did it. I am impressed. Oh, Nursey. Heal me. Thank you. Okay. This episode, I don't think, has gone on too long. It's probably been about ten minutes right now. But, I'm not going to end the part here. I'm just guessing how much time we've gone through right now. So, uh, gosh darn it. But, uh, after I get through this tower, that's probably when I'm going to end the episode. Which should be relatively soon, I'm guessing. This tower can't go on forever, can it? Nope, there's Skyla right there, in fact. Just in case something happens, yeah, semi-port, you can still lead off. Okie dokie. What's going on up here, Skyla? I don't remember the voice I did for you, but... We'll see what happens. Oh, you came, thank you! I was right when I saw it. It was a hurt Pokemon. Don't worry, though, it's fine now. Give it a max revive, it felt better and flew away. Hee <laughs> hee, don't have great eyesight. No matter how far the way things are, a pilot's eyes can always see him. Oh, that's right, since you've come this far, why don't you ring the bell? Celestial Tower Bell is soothing for Spears Pokemon. Blah, 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 blah. Sure, I'll ring the bell, thank you. Yeah, sure, she said to. Don't understand how this bell is soothing. Right. Skyla, I did it for you. What a pretty sound. Celtic, you're saying it. Okay, yeah, you know what? We're going to see you tomorrow at this Mistralton City Gym. I'm going to actually try off screen to remember to face all of those trainers I've purposely skipped so far. So, if you like this part, I'd appreciate a like. Any thoughts, comments, concerns, plates, leave them down below in the comment box. Otherwise, I'm going to say, um, have a good day, I guess. I don't know what else I would say. Have a good day.